Why, hello there, everybody. Welcome back to Club Penguin Rain yet again. As you all know, you guys saw the first video earlier today, which was, of course, called Four Years on Club Penguin Rain. And I'm talking about me, of course, because that's today, as you all know. So, as you can see, I am back in my loot right here, but we're not actually going to be here at all. We already did that in the last episode. As you guys know, I told you guys by the end of the last episode that in this video, we would be doing other combinations. And this is to make up for not doing them this past December. Guys, I was locked out of the game at the time, so I wasn't able to do it. Now we're going to make it up by doing it today. And I actually think we again did this two years ago today on March 12th, 2019. Hold on just one second, let me go see if that's actually true. Yes, I did. Nice. Now we're doing it again. Alright, now let's get into it, shall we? Okay, so obviously we're gonna leave the igloo. Well, actually, originally, I actually did this in my igloo itself. But do we really need to do that? No, no we don't. So, let's go ahead and let's do this in... Hmm... Normally we do it in the beach for uh, at least December. Normally we do it like right here, but since this area is blocked by all this stuff, we can't do it in that spot. So instead, we'll have to do it right... Oh, no, 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 I did not mean to go into the lighthouse. No, 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 we're not going in here. There we go, that's where I wanted to go. Let's go ahead and get started with some outfit combinations. Woo! Seriously, this is going to be fun. Now, in this, I originally did 16 outfit combinations. This time, however, we are going to be doing 18 outfit combinations. Why is this? Well, to be honest, first off, it's been like almost two years since the last time I did an outfit combination thing. Because mainly, we mainly do those in December, but last year it was an exception because I couldn't get into the game at the time. Ah. Oh boy. So, to make up for all of that, we're doing 18 of them. To make up for the fact that I haven't done this in almost two years. Wow. <laughs> and no, I'm not mad. I'm actually pretty surprised. I'm not mad at all that I haven't done this in like so long. No, I'm actually quite surprised that it's been quite a long time. So with that being said, now let's finally jump right into it. Now since it's been almost two years since we last did the outfit combination, you can easily see a ton of items have come to my inventory since then. If you take a look, as you can see, a ton of new items. Hold on, that's all old. Yep, as you can see, a ton of new items have come to my inventory since the last time we did Alpha Combination. I mean, a lot of new items have come out since we last done Alpha Combination. Making last year the only year without Alpha, uh, Alpha Combination that I would not do. So as you can see, some items have, were not even here the last time we did this. See? Some of these weren't even here the last time we did this. That is actually insane. Anyway, let's get started. Outfit combination number one. And yes, that's the only time I'm going to mention it. Oh, and remember, one more thing. I want to mention one more thing before we officially get started. Every time I do an outfit combination, normally... Whatever item I'm wearing, I normally tell you where, what party that came from, or whatever catalog that came from. Just like the old days, we're doing that again, because it's fun, and I love to look back at stuff. Especially on this game. Alright, here we go! Now, time to explain where Right here, we got the CP 15th Anniversary hat, which of course came from this past October's CP 15th Anniversary event on Club and Green Bay. The, uh... Pixelated glasses came from, I think, the fair of 2020. 
this uh, Halloween green scarf actually I think came from last year's Halloween party as well. The shirt came from the third anniversary party for Clubbing Rewritten last year. This surfboard came from last year's music jam. And the only thing to not come from last year is the slippers, which was in a code in April 2017 for Easter. However, also made a return in this week's most recent code for Clubbing Rewritten. So this go this these items right here, the funny slippers, have appeared in two different codes. How impressive is that? Alright, time for the second outfit combination. Oh, and one more thing, I will be moving locations for each. So next, we're gonna go to the ski village. Wow, there's literally nobody here. Oh wait, what server am I on again? <laughs> right, I'm on a server that literally nobody is on. Almost nobody else. Next outfit combination, the second one. Alright, the second outfit combination. Have a look. In the background are pins since I want to keep it the same for like the next week or so. Normally I do that, but this time I just want to just keep them the same. Like I said, it's called outfit combinations. So that means I have to change my entire penguin here to look completely different. Now, here's where every one of these items were from. I know you can look these up on the Club and Rewritten Wiki, but if you don't want to, I can just tell you them right here. For those who don't know, the hot item I'm wearing right now came from the fair of 2020. In fact, this item was actually in my first part of my fair 2020 walkthrough. I also earned that. I also earned this item in the daily spin, which was also very, very cool. Next up, we have the Eclipse Glasses. This originally was released in the Eclipse of 2018, right before the Halloween party. A week before the Halloween party being out. But that's not the only time these items have been released. Nope. These were also re-released again at the Festival of Lights last January. This scarf came from the St. Hadrick's Day party of 2019, which in like three days, that'll be two years since this item was released. The next item is this item right here that came from last year's January catalog. And of course, the item I'm holding right here, this boom box, of course, came from last year's music jam. And this last item, these shoes, came from last year's December catalog. How cool is that? It was actually one of the secrets in the catalog, to be exact. All right, out the combination number three. Oh wait, right, I said we would be moving locations every time. Nice, nobody up here. I don't really mind if there's anyone up here, but it's kind of cool if it's just me, especially while I'm doing this. It's more fun that way. Next! All right, out the combination number three. All right, here's where all these items came from if you don't know. The Red Propeller Cap came from the April Fool's Party of 2017. The Ghost Goggles came from the Halloween Party of 2018. The Scarf came from the Halloween Party of 2019, I think at least. This Hoodie came from last year's Fair once again. My god, I'm bringing the, the Fair 2020 a lot in these. My god, it's because there were like so many items released at the Fair last year. No wonder my inventory is full of those items. Next up, we got these cool items, which was released, released in the October 2017 clothing catalog. And finally, these slippers were released in the Christmas Party 2018, like the, glo uh, the global prizes. This was one of the global prizes in the Christmas Party of 2018. How cool is that? And of course, let's move to another location. Let's move to the dock. Right. <laughs> uh, last time I did this, the dock didn't even look like this. How crazy is that? Next outfit combination. Number four to be exact. Alright, here we go. Here we go, guys. Outfit combination number four. Here we freaking go. So right here, we have the diamond backing helmet from, for once... The Fair 2019. Yep, finally something that is not from the Fair 2020. And also, no, literally none of these items came from that party. 
Next up, we have the uh, the giant blue sunglasses, which came as one of the global prizes in the fair 2018. Next up, we have the lavender cape, which was actually the first ever item of the month in August 2018. This beta shirt was a code released for CP's 12th anniversary in 2017. The grappling hook was from Operation Blackout in 2017. And also, the same goes with these shoes as well. The anti lava boots. That is our fourth out combination. On to the fifth one. In, well, you can see where I'm going now. The town. My god, it feels so weird having this server empty. It's because I am on a server that literally almost no one is on. That's why it's all empty here. Next album combination, which will be the fifth one. Alright. So, album combination number five. Take a look. It's actually pretty interesting. So, everybody, here we go. So, the Chili Trek Hat was released originally at the Mountain Expedition 2017. Although, believe it or not, that event actually occurred before I even joined the game. So how did I get it, you might ask? Well, on April 11th, 2017, there was a glitch where you could get sent back to the Mountain Expedition through one of the portals in the Box Dimension. It was a weird glitch and was fixed if you cleared your cache on that day to get the Easter Egg Hunt. Since I never did it at the time and I finally discovered the glitch, I was able to get this item. No matter. What? Anyway, these, all these other items I know where they came. Anyway, the uh, green sunglasses came from the Summer Luau of 2018. Then, the blue bandana came from the fair of 2019. Then, this item here came from the March 2019 Penguin Stop. The trick or treat basket came from the Halloween party of 2017 in the Haunted House. And lastly, these dragon feet came from last year's July catalog. And Penguin Salad, of course. Alright, now we have moved on to the snow fort. Let's do the next alpha combination, which is number six. Alright. Alright, here is alpha combination number six. Oh boy, these are a lot of cool items. I'm just gonna admit that right now. These are. Alright. So, all where all these items came from, the Green Propeller Cat, that was released in the Festival of Flight. Yep, the Festival of Flight. Not last. No, no, no. That was last year. No. Festival of Flight was in 2017. In August. The middle of August, to be exact. The Yellow Storkel, I think, was just recently released at the Submarine Party. Yeah, it was recently released at the Submarine Party. I think that might have been the only place it was released. I don't remember if there were any other parties that it was released in besides the most recent Submarine Party. That just ended like five days ago. Next up, we have the Seashell Necklace, which was released originally at the Water Party of 2017. I don't remember if it came back at the next one. I don't remember. I'm going to have to go check. But I remember it originally being released at the Water Party 2017. The Blue Letterman Jacket was released in the Penguin Style of March 2017. The Desert Mar uh, Maracas were released in the Winter Fiesta of 2018. And I think were also released again, I think the year after, in 2019. I think at least. And then finally the box shoes came from, well, all the April Fool's parties. But of course, obviously originated at the April Fool's party of 2017. And yes, I'm talking about this all mentioning, all mentioning to the game itself. You know, Club Henry Red. Yep, I'm telling you where all the, when all these items came out inside Club Henry Red. Not the original Club Penguin, of course. No, 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 no. That was all many years back even before this. Back before I even played. I don't know, we're talking about Club Henry Red in here. Not the original Club Henry Red. Alright, we're going to do outfit combination number seven right here at the stadium. Let's do it. Alright. So, alpha combination number seven, I believe. Let's have a look. Okay, here we go. So, first one, this item right here, the hat, was released at the Wilderness Expedition of 2017. 
the greedy glasses I think were released in the April 2017 catalog. Then I think the life vest I think was released at the submarine party, or uh, I don't know what other party was it at? Because I know I did see it at the submarine party. I did see it there, but I don't know where else. Anyway, the guitar was released as a code for the Music Jam 2018. Why would it release? Then this hoodie was released in the April 2019. Hang us up. And finally, these sandals were released at Dig Out the Dodge. Next out, the cottage, which will of course be located at the plaza. So, let's do it. Alright, album combination number, I think, 8, I believe, out of 18. My god, we still got like, like 11 more to do after this. Oh boy, that's gonna be uh, something. Anyway, let's go ahead and um, yeah, let's have a look. Okay, so this first item was released, I think, last year at the fair. Not as a mystery prize, but I think one as the, one of the regular prizes. I think at least I'll have to go check. So with that being said, these uh, you know, these of course were released at the. Uh, actually, it was a code in 2019 for Canada Day. So, yeah. And then the scarf right here, you know, talking about this, was released at the Halloween party 2019 as a daily item. Next up, we have the Music Jam t-shirt, which was released at the first ever Music Jam. My lord, that's crazy. Okay, uh, the stamp here was released at the Medieval Party 2018. Finally, these shoes were released also at the Fair of 2020. My god, so many items from the Fair of 2020. My god, that, was, that, was, that was probably one of the best fairs we ever had here. It was just so good. Alright, we're gonna do outfit combination number 9 here, I believe, at the Forbes. Let's do it! So what I did here was, well, take a look. This is a combination from plenty of different events. So, the uh, Ice Santa hat came from one of the global prizes in the Christmas Party 2018. The Stash here was one of the mystery prizes in the Fair 2019. But the Necklace was one of the prizes in the Fair 2017. And then this shirt had been pretty much released at literally every single music jam, I think, except for last year or something. I don't know, I can't remember. I think the golden microphone, actually, hold on a second. If I remember correctly, this golden microphone, I can't, I think it came out... You guys remember that concert at the middle of April last year that was held? I think that's where this item came from. At least was released in the game. And finally, but not least, these shoes came from the October 2017 style cap. Nice, right? Alright, now with the go. Let's do outfit combination number 10. I think it. Alright. Hey, uh. Outfit oh, combination number 10, I believe this is it? Anyway, I got loads of items here. It's actually insane. So. The Strong Gardening Hat was released originally at the Earth Day Party of 2017. Uh, next item, these, uh, you know, goggles here. These were originally released in the August 2017 Penguins Battle, but were also brought back three years later in January of 2020 in the Penguins Battle catalog as well. At least from that's from what I remember. Next up, this light blue and white scarf was actually also released in January 2020's catalog. Because remember, we didn't get a January catalog this year, because the game came back online at the middle of the month, if you remember. Anyway, uh, the Black MV Free Player, if I remember correctly, this was the item you would get after completing the record hunt in the Music Jam 2018. Again, trying to remember this all by memory, guys, just want to make that clear. Anyway, uh, these 
sweater came from the uh, one of the global prizes in the Christmas party 2018. My God, I am praying that out a lot. The sack. Finally, these shoes were originally released in the August 2017 Penguin Style as well. I think they were released in some other catalogs after that, a few years later. I don't remember which ones, but I do remember them being released a few years later in other Penguin Style catalogs. For now though, let's make our way over to the mine. All right, we are now at the mine. So let's do outfit combination number 11, I believe. Yeah, I think it's 11. Only seven more after this, which isn't too bad. We've actually been doing really good so far. All right, so. All right, so outfit combination number 11. Let's see what we have here. Tried to go really good with items here. I've been doing that for all of these, obviously. Of course. I mean, yeah, we all know that, of course. <laughs> anyway, um, let's stop messing around. Anyway, the point is... Alright, here we go. So, this item, which is the Ringmaster hat, was originally released at the Fair of 2017. Next up was the Red Nose, which was released at the Red Nose Day, uh... So, I believe leaving, uh... 2019, I believe? No, 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 sorry. Actually, that was a code, actually. Yeah, yeah, my mistake. That was actually a code. <laughs> ah, sorry about that, guys. I completely forgot. Uh, okay, next up, the Candy Cane Scarf was released in 2018, also as a code during the Christmas party of 2018. Next up, this uh, wizard outfit was released originally in the May 2017 Penguin Style Catalog. The Cosmic Umbrella was released during the half. Great Storm of 2017 and the Great Storm of 2020 was located in the Ski Village. And finally but not least, the Blue Roller Skates were released in the August 2017 Penguin Style Catalog. Where to next? Okay. So, uh, yeah, we're at the expert now. Sorry for not being there for a second. Ah, uh, all right. I kind of forgot what number it was. I think this is alpha combination number twelve. We are really close to being done. Thank God. And I'm already starting to run out of ideas. All right. Right here, we have the, uh, the Sephora, which was released at the Earth Day party of 2019? Earth Day party 2019, I believe, is when this item was released. Okay, next up, the fish painting here was released at the Adventure Party of 2018. Well, the Island Adventure Party, 2018. Yeah, my mistake. Anyway, uh, this, you know, um, Pro Year was, of course, released at the, ha, uh, uh, Medieval Party, 2018, and was also released again at the Medieval Party, 2020. This was released in the November 2017 Penguin Style. This was released in the May 2017 Penguin Style. Finally, uh, wait, what item did I put on again? I do not remember putting that item on. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, I don't know what to do for a B item. If I had to guess where these came from, I want to say last October, I believe. Okay, I'm not sure. Next! All right, so our next outfit combination is right here. This is outfit combination number 13, I believe. Yep, we are only, we need only five more to do after this one. Dang, we've done so many of these. I'm already again running out of ideas. All right, here we go. Here, freaking go. 
So. Anyway, these items. This first one, the reindeer antlers, was actually released at many holiday parties, actually. First one at the Christmas party 2017. Then again at the Christmas party 2018, if I'm not mistaken. And then I think again also at the holiday party 2019. And I'm not sure if these were released again at the Holiday Party 2020, because I wasn't there! Uh, I don't know. I don't know how many Holiday Parties these have been released in. I want to say at least three of them so far. Could be wrong. I wasn't at last year's Holiday Party. Fortunately. So I didn't know. I could just check the wiki, though. Heck, I could do that for literally every item I've been doing here. Anyway, these glasses, I think I definitely remember being released at the... Halloween Party 2019, and then I think this, hmm, I want to say, my god, I, I almost don't even remember when this item was released, hmm, let me go look that up, okay, so, just want to clarify, I did look up when some of these were released, so apparently this was released in the Halloween Party of 2000, Nice! Kind of forgot about that! Okay, let's continue. Hold on, we got a friend request. Who the heck is it? Yeah, why the heck not, to be honest with you. Cool. Okay, uh, back to me. Okay, so now I remember where that came from. I do remember where the rest of these did, though. Ugh. All right. This item right here came from the Adventure Party 2018. How would Adventure Party 2018 make that? Uh, this was actually last year's item of the month in October. And these came from the Mountain Expedition of 2017. <sighs> Almost five more of these to do. Man, I'm starting to run out of, I'm starting to run out of ideas already. Wait, is this open? Yes, it's open! Yes! It's open now! Oh god, that's cool. Nice. Obviously, of course, we're still working on Karjutsu, of course. Obviously. You have to wait for that. But uh, I don't mind that one. Hey, at least it's cool that the room is finally open. We just gotta wait for Karjutsu now. But again, I don't mind. And guess what? You know what? For the heck of it, let's just do it. Um, uh, hold on, is this open yet? Okay, good. Okay, I just wanted to see if that was open yet. At least the JoJo's open. First time I've went in here since the game came back. I didn't even know it was open until today. So, let's do our 14 Alpha combination. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Alpha combination number 14. So, let's do it. Alright, if I remember correctly, this item right here was released during, I think, the March 2019 panel style, I believe? This next item was released during the Halloween Party 2020. This next item, right here to be exact, was released in the October 2019 panel style. This item right here was released in the June 2017 panel style. The sword right here, I think, was released during... Uh, is this the sword I remember from 2018? I think it is. I don't know. Anyway, the last one, these feet, are from the Fairy Fable Stage Play. And that is it for outfit number 14. Let's do number 15 at... Oh. Alright, if I'm not mistaken, this is outfit combination number 15. Yes. We are doing it here at the Beacon! That's what I meant to say, I meant to say at the Beacon first before saying out the combination number 15. Ah, oh, rip man. Anyway, uh, um, the point is, let's actually do this. So, first off, the Yellow Miner's Helmet was released in the October 2017. Penguin style catalog for classic items. These goggles were released, I believe, in the August 2018 Penguin Style. The Hawaiian Lei was actually released at the Winter Fiesta 2018. 
Uh, what was the other time it was released? Maybe I think the year after? I don't remember. But, uh, the double, um, uh, next guitar was released in the 2017 Music Jam, I believe. The Hawaiian shirt was released in the July 2017 Penguin Style. And also, the Sandals release sandals as well. So that's pretty neat. Whoa! Okay, I did not realize this music actually played in here. Yo, this brings flashbacks to last April. During the April Fool's party. Yo! That is pretty dang sweet, I must admit. Now time for outfit combination number 16. Out of 18. We're so close. Alright, so the uh, 16th of the combination, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, let's get into it. So, we have the blue tope, which was originally meant to be from tipping the iceberg in 2017 in October. So, the next one is the smoke goggles from Operation Blackout in 2017. Next up was the gold medal from the Penguin Games in 2018. The staff and shield, uh, well, the white staff and shield. Or whatever, from medieval, all medieval foreign staff. And then the Frankenstein outfit from the October 2017 catalog, and I think it's been released in every catalog for October 2nd. And then finally, the gold checker shoes from last year's fair. We'll do outfit combination number 17 right here, just to be clear. Alright, outfit combination number 17 out of 18. My god. Only just one more after this. Thank god, I'm actually really running out of ideas. There's, I want to save the best one for last, which should be a very, very, very common outfit that you guys will see in a few seconds. For now, though, let's take a look at what I'm doing here for our 17th one. So, the green uh, minor summit was an item released in the April 2017 Penguin Style Catalog. Now, these glasses, I don't remember if these were released via the Spy Gear or a uh, random catalog. I don't know. I kind of forgot. I do know when the rest of these were. This leg was released during the 2 million code back when Clubbing Rewritten hit 2 million players in the beginning of June 2018. June 2nd, to be exact. Next up, this shirt is from the Music Jam 2017. This Penguin Play Award thing is actually from last year's Penguin Play Awards. That's one of the items. Um, I think at least. And finally, these are from, I believe, the Monster Maker catalog, and I think in almost all Halloween parties, or maybe just at least the first one in 2017. I don't remember, but hey, at least I mentioned it here otherwise. And finally, but not least, number 18. Yes! One of those most important classic outfits. You got pretty much everything. Take a look! Of course, you got the famous Red Meyer helmet that I wear pretty much every single day on this game. Which this was released in May of 2017 for the Clubbing Rewritten Improvement Project. These were actually released in the Adventure Party of 2019. And then this leg was released as a code during the Water Party of 2017, but was also re-released again in September 2019. Also for a code too. Then the Illuminati Jacket was released at the Waterlawn Party in February slash March of 2018. The bell was released at the uh, construction of the Christmas party of 2017. And I couldn't find a good enough fee item, so we're just going to go with that one. Anyway, that is the end of this episode of Clipping the New I'm just going to close this off, put this away, and well, that's it for another video. So everybody, like and subscribe if you all enjoyed, and I will see you later for... Well, I guess Legos Island, and then that's it for today. So, without... Well...
with that being said, see you guys later. I know I said I would be doing one more Club and Revenge video, but honestly, I'm not up to it right now. Plus, I just spent a ton of time making this. So, yeah, I think we're good enough here. Comment down below which numbered uh, alpha combination was your favorite. And yeah, that's it. Can I wait to do this again sometime soon.